face. Why are you applauding someone for suddenly acting like a normal member of society? It's like, it's like I've lost a bit of weight. I've lost about 20 pounds. Exactly. What? No. No. You're basically applauding me for only eating as much as I need now. I should have, I should have always been doing that. I got fat because I was a greedy, lazy bastard. There's no other explanation. And I, I, I need people that they come to me now and they go, oh well, oh, well done, you look great. But they weren't telling me I looked terrible. They're basically saying I looked terrible. They, no, don't, no one told me at the time it was really taboo. I needed waiters to come over and go, fuck off, you've had enough. Right? <laughs> and I've been criticised in the past for having a go at fat people. I've never had a go at fat people. I've only ever pointed out the fact that you get fat if you take in more calories than you burn off. That's simple science. I don't judge them in any other aspect of their life, but that's what happens. You get fat if you take in more calories than you burn off, okay? And th that's indisputable, okay? Now, the thing is, people think I'm having a go. I'm not, because I don't judge them. If I see a fat person, I don't make assumptions about him other than how they got fat. And, this is the other thing, they not, no, wait, wait, right? <laughs> Not only is that what makes you fat, people know that's what's making them fat. No one got fat behind their own back. <laughs> no one uh, and, uh, and went, what the fuck's that? Okay. <laughs> it's not a surprise. It's a gradual process. You have loads of time to back out from this project. <laughs> uh, and he, also, no one's sneaking into thin people's apartments and uh, injecting their lettuce with a million calories. That doesn't happen, okay? They know what to do. If you've got to a bloke and he's surrounded by cakes and pies, right, and you go, you know what's making you fat, don't you? He doesn't go, is it all the running? He knows what it... <laughs> but I don't make judgments, okay, other than how they got fat, okay? If I see a fat person, I don't go, oh, he's fat, therefore he's jolly, right? <laughs> a lot of them are miserable aren't they? <laughs> if, if I see a fat girl, I don't go, oh, she'd be pretty if she lost weight. That's rarely the case. Okay? <laughs> so don't fall for that, okay? <laughs> a lot of them started eating because they had fuck all to lose. So, no. But there's no stigma attached, because it, that, people don't even want to use the word fat now, because I think it's derogatory. It's a real taboo subject, so they use euphemisms. They go, oh, you know, Brenda, the f big girl... <laughs> what, seven foot? No, no. Not to. What does she look like? Brenda, you know, she, she's the one who's clammy, even in winter. <laughs> Just say she's fat. Nothing wrong with it. It's their choice. It's up to you if you want to be fat. It's fine. But they don't. They go, you know, Brenda... The, She's out of breath, just standing up at her desk. <laughs> just... But, even though it is their own fault, and it is their own fault, I feel sorry for them, right? No, I do. Particularly, particularly fat women, because fat is a feminist issue. Men get fat, and we just go, fuck it, all bought and paid for, you know. <laughs> we don't come under the same constraints of society. Whereas women are inundated with images of how you should be. Size zero models, this diet, that diet, look like this, keep your man. And they make such an effort, don't they, fat girls? They've all, always got lovely hair, aren't they? They're always having their hair. They've always got lovely hair. Always got lovely hair. Always got those lovely false nails, aren't they? They make an effort. Anything but jogging. Right? <laughs> they love high heels, don't they? They think it makes their legs look less... It doesn't. It just... <laughs> you can just hear him coming now. <laughs> I don't want any fat people to feel uncomfortable at one of my gigs, so next time, buy two seats. I'm, I'm joking. I'm dead. I'm joking. Shut up. I'm not having a go. I'm just pointing out, you know... I was listening to uh, the radio in England a few weeks back, Radio 4, quite highbrow. There was a discussion about political correctness. My name came up straight away, right? <laughs> and there was this woman on there going, oh, yeah, well, it's, it's not right. I'm um, uh, Ricky Gervais. Um, he makes jokes about fat people. Um, he wouldn't make jokes about gay